Hi ladies and gentlemen, this is Tony Hollowitz and in this tutorial I want to show you how to add the quick actions box for Automator for Act to a layout. So after you've downloaded and installed Automator for Act, you have to take some steps to add it to the layout. Now in this particular layout I have not added anything. So I'm going to go up to Tools, I'm going to go down to Design Layouts and then over to Contact right there. Once I do that, this box will pop up so I can modify the layout. Now over here, I want to draw your attention. Up here, there's an option called Custom. When I click on Custom, I see this item called Quick Actions. When you first install Quick Actions or Automator for Act, if you don't see it there, what you have to do is right-click on this gray area, click on Customize, and there will be an option to add this. Now I've already done that so I don't have to do it again. So now that I have the quick actions I'm just going to click on that and bring my pointer over on the screen and I'm just going to click and draw a box. Now I know from experience the general size of this box so I'm going to leave it like that and you'll see I almost have it but I'm just going to make this a little bit bigger. Now just on note on this I can change this box a little bit. I can resize it just a little bit. And I can also add some background colors if I wanted to. So if I want to add a background color to this and a line or borders, I could. I'm not going to do that here. I'm just going to leave it as is. And I'm going to go up and go File. And what I always recommend is when you modify a layout, give it a unique name. In other words, don't save over the original layout. I had set this up in advance, so I gave it a name. This is the 1024 by 768 layout. I had previously put in A for Automator for Act. Automator for Act, I just abbreviated it. And because I already put this name in here, I'm just going to save it as that. So again, don't save over the original layout. So now, here is our layout. I'm going to close this. And again, if you don't see the layout immediately, you might have to switch to it if you're on another layout. Because I'm on it, I don't have to switch. So now we have a contact here where if I picked up the phone and called this gentleman and I wanted to record that, what I would do is I'd typically go up and click on History and I'd record that I completed a call. Now, long story on this, I'm not going to get into here, but I always just use one field, the call reach field. I don't worry about call attempt. For most of us, one field is enough to take care of tracking. So I'm going to click cancel because I don't want to fill that in. I'm not going to save this. So I want to draw your attention right here to the call reach field. If I place a phone call to this person and I want to record it, well, I can come up and simply click on quick call history. And what it does is it records that I called that person today. If I click on history, there it is. But I could have also come up here and typed in call to, and this gentleman's name is Don. I'm going to type in Don. And if I clicked in quick call history, not only would it have taken and recorded the date right here, and this is really important to me, and it should be to you, but it also put the note in right here. Again, if I want to do a one-day follow-up, I'm going to come over to the Activities tab so you can see it happening. I'm going to click on one-day follow-up. There it is. One-week follow-up, two-week follow-up. So from a marketing, telemarketing, sales point of view, the ease in which you have the ability to do this is phenomenal. And that's why I think this tool can be so beneficial for people. It's a great way to record information quickly and easily. And try to imagine if you have a new employee coming on and they're doing things for you. Well, instead of having to train them and making sure they do it the right way every time, you can frankly just get this tool and simplify the process. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Tony Hollowitz. You have a great day. Bye now.